The third dimension in sexy. Please welcome Chris Hardwick. I'll, I'll take it. How's it going? It's going very well, thank you. Now that you're here. I feel uh, I had a weird day before I came here. I was at a franchise coffee place. I'm not going to say the name, okay. but it rhymes with Arbucks. Okay. And uh, <laughs> I opened the bathroom door, and there's just an old Asian man sitting on the can. And he, I was like, you know the lock works, right? And uh, he just had that moment where we just both realized, like, we're in a thing now. And I didn't know how long I should hang out there. Did so. you snap a photo for Flickr? No, what? but I was throwing oh. bleach onto my eyes to try to get the image out. Right. So, uh, so I'm ready for this computer right, well, to let's like, do it. bring yeah. me back into reality. I, uh, I want a computer to take me to the third dimension. That's well, what I want. There is a PC for that, Kev. Oh. Alienware shows us yet again why they're the most popular gaming PC builder with the new Area 51. Its aggressively designed case has motorized vents for active cooling, while the inside is lit for easy access. Add that to an Intel Hexacore processor, dual NVIDIA GTX 480 video card, and two terabytes of storage for one of the highest end gaming experiences on the market, starting at 2,200 bucks. Ah, oh, this is very exciting. Are you gonna get the things going? Wait you for gonna, it. You play? Uh, in a is second or two? In a yeah. second. Oh! 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 Uh, well, we'll talk about that in a second. Seems like gaming PCs are, are getting uh, bigger and bigger these days. This thing is uh, two feet high, two feet deep. We don't normally mention weight, but this thing is a Bieber. It's 90 pounds. <laughs> you need a friend to help you lift this to a LAN party. Yeah, most, um, most of our demographic will not be able to lo lug this around. No, 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 no. They'll have to pay extra it. for delivery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it's also got these active vents, mm -hmm. uh, very porcupine-esque, uh, yep. and customizable lighting. Um, what do you think? I mean, the design, yes, it's, it's oohs and ahs. I mean, you're still going to suck at StarCraft, even with this case. <laughs> but it's impressive. I know, but it's super Bat Lab. I mean, I think it's really awesome. Uh, I, I, I really actually, I like the design. And because it's so large, you're probably going to have to keep, you can't, I don't know how you're going to fit that under a desk and your feet at the same time. Right. So it's cool that it has such a cool design that because it's probably going to be out in the open. Right. Um, and even though this seems like they're pretty ridiculous, the active vents are seriously freaking cool. So just like a Porsche, they raise and lower automatically according to how much your machine needs to be cooled or your ichthyosaur. Uh, one of them uh, uh, stuck a little on a rig, but it still works oh, out. Really guys. Yeah, but it, yeah. it did right itself. It's not it like did, we had to get it in did, there It did right itself. Uh, it. It's so, it's so future-y and robotic. Like, yeah. To come to life. You can customize the outside of the case lights just like Alienware's laptops, which uh, we've always thought was fun because we are fascinated by colored lights, oh. apparently. Oh, green, now orange? Oh, oh, reddish orange. It's like a uh, rave inside my computer it case. It is. That's right. Uh, it's, a, it's a nice touch. We think it's a really cool touch. So well, like here's the, the thing. Aesthetic. The inside of the case has yeah. had about as much of attention uh, to detail as the outside. Uh, this, from here on out, any gaming case or high end PC. That you're paying extra for a case yeah. should open this easily. That's it. There you are inside. Uh, I'm sorry. Let me lose some thumb screws in here and get no. I don't, just I don't know why this is not an industry standard that you can just pop open uh, up here. You got the panels there. There's the hard the hard drive. Actually, the hard drive's on the other side. But you know, you got your your motherboard in there, and then this is the cooling vent, the, the cooling tanks in here. I mean, like this this thing is so easy to access and switch around. I don't know. I mean, I know you like to meddle with little screws. No, and, I don't. Like, I have and I, wires. No, and you don't. I really don't. I really I don't like that. Well, don't like Kevin, stepping on them. Don't like losing let me, them. Let me throw this up in your mug. The hard drives are also uniquely mounted on the opposite side of the case. Just as easy to pop on or, or, or pop cool. out or pop no, in. Like it's right pre-cabled. Any configuration you want. You could put them in little Vs. You could put one in there. You could put six in there. You could put three in there. Have fun with it. Who cares? Uh, the, the internal lighting is even on uh, even when it's not plugged in, so you can make changes more easily. I mean, it's like it is such a ridiculously simple yet brilliant design. Yeah. Um, overall, this is one of the coolest cases that we have ever reviewed viewed inside and out. So, okay, so good job. All right, that's the case. Now let's yep. get to the actual computer. Oh, um, you want to talk about the computer? I kind of do. I okay. kind of do because it really doesn't make any difference if the PC isn't crazy fast. So tell me it's crazy fast. It is one of the crazy fastest ones we've ever reviewed. Oh, it's so crazy fast. In our normal 3D Mark Vantage test, it scored as the second fastest PC we've ever shown uh, on the television, on this program. Main Gear was the first one, which we had on a few weeks ago. It will also play any game on the market extremely well, and even in the third dimension. Oh. You will also need its NVIDIA's third dimension vision kit for an extra 200 bucks. And you can play practically any new game in the third dimension. <laughs> Very cool. All right, so it starts. 
at twenty two hundred bucks. Twenty two hundred. The configuration right. that we have right now is about thirty nine hundred bones. Yep. Um, what are we giving it at that price? Kevin, I want you to hold on to your internal organs because they're about to come shooting out of your stomach. A five out of five, oh, my yeah. friend. This is a fantastic gaming PC. The performance is great. It's as good as we expect from Alienware. They did an incredible job. It's, it's competitively priced. And honestly, the case puts it over the top to a five. So well done. Well, bam. I don't know why I'm high-fiving you. I didn't make this thing, but I'll take some of the credit for it. I own stock. That is it for today's Gadget Prom. But on Wednesday, we're going to review uh, a 3D gaming laptop from ABA direct. So, uh, uh, 3D gaming on the go. Very yeah. cool. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you, Chris Hardwick. Excellent Goodbye, job, everyone. everyone.